Hey, what's up guys? I take him and come in today with another tweak from Cydia. The name of this tweak is Alert Artist. And this tweak allows you to do is allows you to change the color and the FX of your alerts pop-ups that come to your iDevice like when you get a new text message or something else. So this is kind of cool, but it's kind of a tweak that if you like to change every aspect of your iDevice, do jailbreaking, this is one of the tweaks that you would like. But a lot of people don't like doing it. You might think this is a waste of time, but as I show you more of this tweak, you might like it. So, it, it does come as a app and not like something you have to change through settings, so that's cool. So, it's kind of a little icon that says hi. So, you just open that up. Now, you can see I've already been having something, work, been working on something, but I could just change it. So, if I want to go to modify background color, I can change the background color to something like that. One bad thing about this tweak, it does not allow you to give you like a preset of colors. You have to like match and match. That's something I don't like doing. I just like to choose from some colors. But you might like it, you might not. And you can of course change the transparency of it, which is really cool. Because sometimes the pop ups be too much. And you can change the bar the border color, the shadow color, the text color. And you can even change the font. So I can change the font to something like really big this 24 and I could change the body font to something like this so as you can see it's like really big so this tweak is really cool it might be useless to some people but it might not be useless to other people so I could just go to things and it gives you some default ones that you could choose from like black glow hot pink and ice so you can see ice look really cool. And you can of course go back to the default one that come on iDevices. So you don't have to like match and match and be like, oh my god, I I changed and I can't change it back because I liked the old one. So you can just hit default and it's back to the old one. So this is the one that I was working on earlier, test. And as you can see, you can save your themes by just going to uh, background columnist make one real quick and I can just go to themes and I can just hit save current and put a name let's just put test 2 hit save and as you can see I got to choose between which one test 2 or test 1 which is really cool so it one another cool thing about this tweak is it allows you to have it real time so you don't have to respring or anything like that. This is a really cool tweak and I hope you like it. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to leave me a comment below that's telling me if you think this is useless or if you really like it. So that's pretty much it for this video guy. I take helping. Out.